Homa Bay, Kisumu, Siaya, and Busia counties have been severely affected by the ongoing ravaging floods that have left almost 100,000 families homeless. Safari Com Foundation, in partnership with Red Cross, have donated non food items worth 14.7 million Kenya shillings. And from the very beginning, Kenya Red Cross has been our trusted partner. Trusted partner in terms of uh, uh, humanitarian response where the humanitarian uh, challenges. So the 14.7 million is for the non-food item kits. These are the very essential items that those who have been displaced, those who have been impacted by the floods without a place for settlement, they can quickly use. These donations will consist of basic household essentials, reusable face masks, and three months supply of sanitary towels. The household essential kit includes a kitchen set, blankets, jerry cans, sleeping mats, soap, mosquito nets, and an easy to use water disinfectant. The distribution of these donations will be done by volunteers from the Kenya Red Cross Society who have been at the forefront in collecting and distributing food essentials. So these volunteers are the ones then who support together with the local chiefs and administrators to ensure then that the distribution is done. Uh, you can imagine also in this situation of COVID-19, we have to ensure that even the process of distributing does not put the people at risk. So what we normally do is we identify the ground where that distribution should be done and we are able to mark spaces to ensure that there is also that distance that is given so that when people come to collect them, they are not in contact with others. In its efforts to ensure Kenyans are not only protected but also well provided for amid the spread of coronavirus in the country, Kenya Red Cross in conjunction with the government has helped in mapping the most needy people in the country, distributing food and resources from the partners across the country. Uh, if the rains continue, the next region that is going to be uh, affected very much will be the coast region. So already we are responding, for example, in Garissa, but also in Tana River, but we are taking more stocks down to the ground, nearer to where some of those uh, places will be affected so that we can be able to respond faster. In Kajia, the West Pakase area, Red Cross in partnership with Magadi Soda Company distributed non-food items to 200 households displaced by floods. Due to inaccessible roads, Magadi Soda Company provided a helicopter so as to airlift and distribute the donations to the residents of Kajia, the West. So this village has been cut off for over a week now, so they are not being able to access uh, other uh, essential services uh, for their normal life support. And these uh, rains also happen to have effects on uh, its shelter and some lost their household items. So we came specifically to distribute uh, non-food items to support uh, mostly their household needs so that they can be able to uh, prepare meals, they can be able to have something, uh, blankets, uh, mosquito nets and uh, other household uh, items which they require. With disaster after the other, the floods have displaced at least 34,000 households and there are about 196 camps, largely schools and churches, where the displaced families are staying in several counties. Harriet Chimea, Switch TV.